Welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add an image overlay to the screen in OBS. This could be used for live streams or recordings, and could be something as simple as a logo watermark, or a full screen overlay with space for a face cam. If you haven't yet got OBS installed, then you can click the card on screen now to watch my video, showing you how to download, install and set it up. We'll be adding an image overlay in standard OBS, but if you're using a different version like Streamlabs OBS for example, then the method will be very similar and you can still follow along. Remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe if the video helps, let's get into the method. We first need to make sure we have the image ready. If you are confident your image is finalised and is the correct size and file type, then feel free to skip ahead a little. The image will likely need to be the same resolution as your screen or recording resolution if you want it to be a full screen image overlay. If it's just a logo, then this won't matter as much. The image file type should also be a PNG file in order for it to have transparency. The transparent areas will show the video through it in the background. Once you feel you have your image ready, load up OBS and we'll add it in as an overlay. In OBS, look for the sources section. This is where your video input will likely be. Click on the plus icon to add a new source. On the list that appears, click on image. Now give the image a name. You'll probably want to call this overlay or logo, depending on the type of image you are adding. Once the name is set, click on OK. Next, click on browse and navigate to where the image is saved on your PC, and then double click on it once you've found it. It should now show a preview in the box, and if you are happy with it, click on OK. It should now appear above the video preview. You might need to drag the image to scale in the preview in order to make it fit correctly on the screen. You can also use the arrows in the sources section or drag the name of the image to change the order of the sources to bring them forward or backward. And so that is how to add an image overlay to the screen in OBS. Click the card on screen now to watch a video of mine showing you 10 easy ways you can speed up your Windows 10 PC. That video might help improve the performance of OBS and allow you to record in higher settings. Help support the channel by visiting the store, the link is in the description and at the end of the video. If you have any questions, then let me know in the comments below, and if you did find today's video helpful, remember to leave a like, and feel free to subscribe for more tips in the future. Be sure to stick around to see some of my other videos that you might be interested in. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video.